Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and um, of course I'm getting a lot of messages from people that have the famous Connexent HD audio devices. Especially since today Microsoft decided that it is general availability for everything Windows version 2004. That means that technically if uh, you are on 1909 you should be able to see on Windows Update that the May 2020 update is available. But uh, you are right, uh, all of you out there. And you know what? I think a lot of who don't see it right now is pretty much you guys that have the famous HD audio connexent devices. Now, this is a uh, interesting side and it's a complex side and it's a side where we're wondering what's happening exactly. I've been reading a lot of blog posts from uh, some tech journalists. Uh, some actually even saying, you know what, is it the end of upgrades for people that have that device? You know, Microsoft's uh, answer to this is always, well, we're working with Synaptics that makes that device. But the problem is, it's been a long time. I mean, this problem has been lingering since almost the beginning of the release of this update and it's still not fixed and you gotta wonder where's the um where's the problem microsoft saying well we're working with uh syn with synaptics and synaptics not saying anything you know if i'd be microsoft if synaptics is the problem saying you know what we're not really interested in working on this if i'd be Microsoft, I just say it, you know, I just say it. I just say, well, I'm sorry, you guys, but the reason why you can't move on is because Synaptics is not making a driver in any efforts to help you guys. Um, I'd like to know one thing about this. All of you out there, because I see all of you com commenting all the time. What age is your PC? I'm just, let's do a little survey here. So, what age is the average PC with the Connexent HD audio device? All of you that can't upgrade, just tell me what year you bought your PC. I'm curious to see how old the PCs are with that device. Because it's very weird and I'm, I'm a little, uh, you know, I'm just wondering because... I mean, I look at all the posts and it seems that it's well, pretty much only you guys now that are not seeing any of this. And um, we're wondering what's happening. And you know what? Um, I want to talk about it because who's to blame here in this problem? Um, Synaptics? Microsoft? Who exactly is the problem in having this upgrade not going on? So um, all of you out there that can't see the May 2020 update that are stuck on 1909, which, is, by the way, is going to have its last updates in May. Uh, first of all, I really hope that there's a fix before then, because if it's not the case, I'm starting to wonder if somebody really wants to fix this. And uh, the other thing is, uh, well, let me know what age is your PC. Um, even what brand. It can be interesting. And don't forget, some of you might have a fix with the manufacturer updating itself uh, the driver in some way. I've seen some people say, you know what, my manufacturer had an update to it and it worked. So um, just check your manufacturer's website with the model number of your laptop or desktop PC. But for the rest, let me know brand and year of your computer. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.